y'all welcome to day 15 of vlogmas this morning i am so angry at myself i just walked in here to start getting ready to film my recipe video for the day and start vlogmas and i realized while i was at the grocery store yesterday i forgot one ingredient that i need for this recipe so i am about to go throw in some tennis shoes and i guess we're running over to the store so i can grab that ingredient and then we can come back and film our recipe video Let's go. I was walking outside to my car and I looked down and I realized I put on two different shoes. One is an Adidas and one is a Nike. I mean, they look kind of similar, but they are not the same. Let me fix that real quick. Well, now we have matching shoes at least. Let's go. While I was out, I decided to stop by Tractor Supply because I needed some feed. got a bunch of feed that I needed because I have a gift card so I figured why not stock up. I got some cat food, I got some baby chick food, other cat food to start trying, and some dog treats. Let's go check out with this couple hundred pounds of food I got. Got the car loaded down with feed. I came here for the mozzarella cheese, but I also got me some berries. I remembered I needed half and half, and I wanted to try out these Olipops. Let's go check out. I'm back home from running errands. It is currently 12.05, and I want to go ahead and fix myself up some lunch so I can get myself fed, and then I can focus on some work that needs to be done. So, doing the same thing as yesterday, mini bagels and egg bites. And I'm sorry for the screaming baby in the background. I had to put one back in the incubator that I thought was doing a little bad. But it is running around like an absolute crazy thing right now. So maybe it doesn't need to be in the incubator. Anyways, let's make us up some lunch real quick. Into the toaster oven we go. And let's go make us some coffee while this cooks. Apparently this one has proven me wrong. It says, I am just fine. Its eyes were just a little sticky together and that's probably because it was the final one to hatch and it's been in here with varying temps and humidity. But by the way, it is sprinting through the incubator. Maybe I'll go put it back with its friends. You wanna go? You wanna go back? It's like, I am just fine. Yeah, cause it's really stressed out in there. I'll take you out, come on. It is like, excuse me, please return me to my friends. Let's go put you up, little thing. Let's try out the Twix today. This cup that I got the first day of Vlogmas, this simple modern cup that you can get on Amazon or I got mine at Target because it was on sale. I love this thing because it is dishwasher safe. I hate hand washing dishes and I hate hand washing cups and I will buy a cup that is dishwasher safe. That just makes it so easy. But let's make us some coffee. My bagels are almost done. Add in some half and half in there. And we've got this chocolate chip cookie dough coffee syrup. Now, does it really taste like chocolate chip cookies? Not really. It just kind of tastes sweet to me, maybe a little chocolatey. Last night, I was concerned that I was getting sick, and thankfully this morning, I do feel okay, but I am really tired, and I don't know if that's just due to lack of sleep and stress, probably, but I really hope this coffee gives me the strength to power through the recipe video that I am about to film after I eat. Oh yeah, oh yeah. That first sip of coffee is just like chef's kiss. I showed y'all how I made these bagel bites yesterday, so I won't show you how I'm making them again, but I have my two little bagel bites. I have my coffee, and I got these mixed berries at H-E-B because when berries are prepped and ready for me to just eat them right out of the container, I'm gonna eat them and not let them go bad. I'm gonna sit down, fill up my belly, and then it'll be time to film a recipe video. We got a little wiggle bow. He's just wiggling. <laughs> what you doing? 
Bobo, you wiggling on the couch, happy boy. <laughs> My recipe video I'm making for Girl Gone Grilling today is an easy spinach and artichoke dip. So I just pulled out most of my ingredients. I got the little pan I am cooking in. My grill is heating up, so let me whip this together and we'll go get it on the smoker. Just finished assembling the spinach and artichoke dip and now I gotta throw it on the smoker. About to pull this off the grill and it smells absolutely fantastic. My poor dip looks like it's been through war because I was outside trying to get the perfect cheese pull for my video. I did a little taste to make sure that I wasn't gonna poison everybody and this is actually a delicious dip. My mom says she wants me to let it cool and we can freeze it so she can serve it at Christmas. All right, so I just finished editing my recipe video that is gonna go up on my grilling page. So it's 2.35 now. And I'm about to sit here at my computer, write out my caption, post it across all of my social media platforms, and then I won't have to think about Girl Gone Grilling for the rest of the day. It's turned into a rainy and gross afternoon. Apparently, we're getting yet another cold front, which I'm not looking forward to. But it's raining today, which means tomorrow is going to be pretty, and tomorrow we get to build yet another chicken coop. That is my goal, is to knock out the five giant boxes of chicken coop on my carport tomorrow. But let me get this posted so I can shut up about it. I got my video posted and we have a little bit of a break in the rain. So I am heading out to go let my friend's dogs out. I brewed myself a cup of coffee because I was freezing cold. So I try and let pups out three times a day when they're gone. So let's go let them out. Hey boys, you wanna go potty? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, hello, so good to see you, come on. Look at the doggy in the window. <laughs> I love having the couch back up against the window because it's so funny to watch him through the window. What is it? I'm coming, Bo. There's a Cooper there too. <laughs> oh look, there's a kitty. Kitty's everywhere. Homegirl is laying by the door talking to the outside cats. I have a feeling someone is starting to go into heat. Look at her. We gotta get you spayed, ma'am. We gotta get you spayed now that you're fat and happy. Fun fact, I have a 333 day streak learning Spanish on Duolingo. But I'll be honest with you, I only feel like I know pequeño. I don't even know if that's the right word for small, little. Very little amount of Spanish. I feel like I still have a lot to learn. But we're getting somewhere. I know a couple words. Cody got home from work and I just threw some of the white chicken chili that I made a couple of days ago into a pot to heat up. And we're just going to eat leftovers for dinner because we don't want this soup to go to waste. And it tastes good. Time for a crappy job, a.k.a. cleaning up the litter box, which I now have to do every two days since we have a second cat. Hey, Kitty Oscar. What you doing, buddy? So the other day we got the kitties a little cat house. It's like a little insulated cat house and we stuck it out here for them to get used to. So maybe they will use it during the winter. Ain't that right? I've fed this one for two years and I still can barely pet him. I can sneak in a pet every once in a while, but he does not want to get pet. All right, y'all, I wanted to hop on here and wrap up today's vlog. It's getting late, it's about 10.30, and I need to go get this edited and uploaded so I can hit the hay. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog today. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and I will see y'all again tomorrow. Bye, guys.